Good morning and praise the Lord. God is good and he's what? He's worthy to be praised. This is Elder Ray. I just want to thank you for stopping in for another dynamic devotion. The title of today's devotion is called Only the Best. And our scripture reading is John chapter 1 verses 35 to 44. The Bible reads in John chapter 1 verse 40, Andrew, Simon Peter's brother, was one of those men who had heard what John said and then followed Jesus. Andrew had been part of a very successful religious movement led by John the Baptist. At the time, nobody was bigger than John. He was well-known, influential, and young. There appeared to be no end to his ministry. The men who had chosen to follow him were enjoying God's blessings every day. Then came Jesus. Then came Jesus. He was bigger news than John the Baptist. He was unknown at first, but his presence was undeniable. John was doing awesome work, but there was something more about Jesus. He spoke with authority, walked with determination, and performed with power unlike anything John's followers had ever seen. Andrew had to choose. If he stayed with John, he could have a life of God's blessings. But when Jesus confronted Andrew, he realized this man was offering something more. Nothing this world has to offer can compare with what God has to offer, and that's Jesus Christ. Amen. So many of us, we have that choice in life. You know, you live in a nice house, you drive a nice car, you have a nice job, and that's all good. But it's not the best. It's not the best. I had all that before Christ. It's not the best. There was still emptiness, still loneliness. There was reason why we drank and partied and acted crazy. Because we needed hope. We needed help. We needed our sins forgiven. We needed the best. And I wouldn't trade any of that for what I have right now. Amen. I could not imagine my life without Jesus Christ. So I just hope and pray that even though you have it good and you might be living good, accept God's best. Amen. And the prayer is, Jesus, never allow me to settle for the good when I can have the best in you. Amen. Amen. And please share this with somebody. You know somebody that needs God's best. Because... Ultimately, things and stuff and what we consider good, it's not really all that good. Right? Well, God bless you and have a great day.